Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today I'm going to be going over the new Final Edition cards. Just like every week, four go into the collection, and you get one as a reward. You get 5,000 coins, the card obviously, and a Lombardi Up Pack. Uh, so the first card up to into the collection is Tommy Bohannon, 88 overall fullback for the Jets. He gives plus eight, uh, plus eight to long pass chemistry and plus 13 to speed run chemistry. Um, a decent fullback, but I wouldn't suggest using him on your team since he's an 88. Much better options are out there. He has 91 strength, uh, 98 injury, I guess, 80 acceleration with 77 speed, uh, 82 trucking, not the greatest for a fullback. He's got 80 stiff arm and 75 carry, so he can carry the ball a little bit. Um, he can't catch the ball, really. Um, and his run blocking stats are average, I would say. 82 run block, 88 run block strength, and 81 run block footwork. His pass blocking stats are less than to be desired, so I wouldn't use him as a pass blocker. Next is Marlon Brown, 91 overall wide receiver for the Ravens. He gives plus 8 to ground and pound, and plus 11 to short pass chemistries. This is more of a viable card, but still not one I would suggest. Plenty of wide receivers higher overall um, that are better suited than he is. Uh, the 94 speed and 91 acceleration are decent uh, with 93 re release. He's got a decent catching at 90, 93 jumping, uh, a decent stamina at 91. Awareness is 82, which is probably bringing his overall down a little bit. Uh, he has a decent route running at 85 and okay catching stats at 90, catching traffic 93 spec catch. Um, but other than that, he, he's, he doesn't have any standout stats. He's kind of a lower tier balanced card. So next is Xavier Rhodes, a 92 overall cornerback for the Vikings. He gives plus 9 to run stuff and plus 10 to zone defense chemistries. And just like the rest of the cards, unless you're a fan of the team or the player, there's no real sense in using most of these cards. Uh, he's got 94 speed and 93 uh, acceleration, a really, really exceptional 97 jumping, uh, 90 stamina. Uh, if you happen to intercept the ball, he's got 75 elusiveness, 76 ball carrier vision, and 78 juke move. Uh, his defensive stats, 67 tackling, not the greatest, but the what, what really counts, pursuit 75, play rec 87, man 92, uh, zone 95, and press 90, so he's more of a zone corner. Uh, next is Delaney Walker, a 93 overall tight end. Not a bad option, but not uh, not a top tier tight end option. Uh, he gives plus 11 to both short pass and speed run chemistries. Uh, so all in all, a decent tight end, maybe a good second tight end or a hybrid option for your first. So he's got 88 speed with 90 acceleration. Not not bad speed for a tight end. Uh, he's got some good catching at 86. He doesn't have terrible route running or spec catch at 77 and. 5, 84 release and 82 catch and traffic, 90 stiff arm and 94 trucking. The 94 trucking could be a reason to use him. He can run block with 81 to 82 run block and run block strength. He can't pass block very well. So use him as a receiving tight end or a run blocking tight end. And the collection reward is Brandon Boykin, 96 overall cornerback for the Eagles. He gives plus 10 to man defense and plus 9 to pass rush chemistries. This is more of a card that is viable for use, but still better cornerback options out there. Uh, but he's got 94 speed and 96 acceleration, a nice 97 agility and 95 jumping. 90 stamina, which is fine. He's got some good moves if you happen to intercept the ball. Uh, good spin and juke move. He's got 95 elusiveness, 75 carry, so he won't fumble the ball after getting an interception. He's got 72 tackle, which is a little bit better than some of the corners that you have an option of using. He's got 97 man and 93 zone coverage, so great zone coverages. 92 play rec, which is pretty good, and 86 press and 86 pursuit. The press is less than to be desired, but just don't press him, and you should be good. Uh, so that's going to do it for this week's final editions. Let me know what ones you are going to use, and uh, I will catch you guys in my next video. Peace out, guys.